Woolworths' new fully automated Melbourne South Regional Distribution Centre is a state-of-the-art facility in Melbourne's southeast. All pallets will be received and placed onto an infeed. For deliveries with advanced shipping notice, pallets will be express received and truck turnaround times will be significantly faster. Manual receipt deliveries are also accepted but will take longer to process. All pallets will then be unloaded in pairs and put onto conveyor infeed for receiving. Once on the infeed, the system will perform a number of checks on all pallets to ensure they are safe and ready to enter the DC. That will include checking the shape, weight and height of your products, checking SSCC labels are readable and that the wood pallet is of high enough quality to be transported through the DC. Every new product has its exact cart and details entered at the teach-in station to make sure product data is accurate, which allows store pallets to be built safely and efficiently. Our high base storage is over 40 metres tall and can hold up to 60,000 pallets with a range of 11,500 different products. Pallets will be called from the high bay when store orders are received. At the defoil station, our team members will remove shrink wrap from the pallets. The amount of shrink wrap removed is based on the number of layers required, calculated from total store demand. The removed shrink wrap is then taken away for recycling. The defoil station is also a final checkpoint to ensure the physical product matches what is in the system and to make sure the pallet and cartons are fit for the rest of the automation system. Packaging quality and consistency will be incredibly important for the automatic pallet delayering. Using pressure and suction, entire layers will be taken off and the cartons will then be separated for transfer into trays. Size limits will decide how many cartons are placed on each tray. Some products will not be fit for automatic pallet delayering. For these products, our team members will manually remove cartons from the pallet at ergonomic workstations and place the cartons directly into trays. Once all of the cartons are on their trays, they will be transported via one of two sorters to the case buffer area. Having a second sorter is one of several redundancies throughout the system created to ensure store service continuity. Cartons are temporarily stored in the case buffer area until they are ready to be picked for our stores. The case buffer has space for more than 200,000 trays. Trays stored in this area will be used for goods to person picking and automated case picking. The case buffer delivers trays in the sequence which builds the best possible pallets for our stores. Our goods to person stations let us pick small and security lines in an ergonomic way. These lines are picked into boxes and grouped based on the unique layout of each store. To make things simpler for stores, these cartons are also labelled with the section destination within that store. At the automated case picking stations, two robots work together to build safe, store-friendly pallets. The first robot moves the carton from the tray to a pickup point, where the second robot picks the carton up and places it on the store's pallet. The pallets are built for stability and safety, whilst grouping like products based on our unique store layouts. This makes filling shelves simpler for our store teams. Pallets are automatically wrapped and labelled with store-specific information, such as the aisle or aisles that the products on the pallet belong in. Now that we can provide more information about exactly what is on the pallet, stores can make better informed decisions about what immediate action to take with their deliveries – fill now or fill later. We have a fleet of automatic guided vehicles, or AGVs, to marshal pallets for dispatch and also for internal point-to-point -point movement of pallets. Each pallet's weight and height is considered as we load them into our trailers. Completing this task safely is a key part of our commitment and position in the chain of responsibility. MSRDC has been designed to contribute to Woolworths' corporate responsibility commitments around environmental sustainability. MSRDC uses smart energy management and water harvesting and the rooftop houses enough solar panels to power around 250 homes. Most importantly, MSRDC will provide huge benefits for our team's safety by eliminating more than 11.5 million kilograms of manual handling in our supply chain each week. MSRDC will support our stores to create better experiences together. MSRDC will help our stores service the future needs of our customers by improving on shelf availability, accuracy in order fulfilment and broadening the product ranges delivered to individual stores. By providing our stores a simpler, faster and safer experience when dealing with pallets, 
Our store teams can focus on what's most important, serving our customers. 